What's up, Joe? Do I sound any better today? I hope so, because I'm using my nicer microphone. It should be picking up a lot better levels. I wound up having to run the microphone, which is right here, out of frame, down to the recorder, which is plugged in, and then I ran a cable from that to the camera all the way over there. So uh, hopefully this sounds all right. I sure hope so. That is another feature of the GH4. It does actually have uh, audio levels on the camera, so you can tell whether or not it's peaking. All right, talking about lights since you just got some. Uh, I'm using one 150 watt, as well as the lights in my kitchen, to light myself right now. Now, I don't know how much you know about lights, but I'm sure you know that for lighting a person, you need a soft light, or you want a soft light. That way you wind up, it's, it's a much more flattering light. The softer the light is, the more flattering it becomes because it, it basically, it smooths out the, the imperfections on your skin and it makes you look better. Uh, and so any large budget film will use really soft lighting. And so that, that soft lighting is then associated with a higher budget. <laughs> so to create softer light, you can either shine it through like a soft box or an umbrella, or you can do what I did, which is I just took my 150 watt light and I reflected it off of my wall. So instead of it being one single point of light, it's now spread out across my entire wall. And basically it, well, it, it becomes really soft that way. So an example of a not soft light would be the sun, obviously because it's really small and it's really far away. So it creates really harsh shadows on it. And so in movies, what they'll do is they'll use diffusion to diffuse the light and, uh, and make it softer on the subject. So this is one of, one of my 150 watt lights. This is the one I'm not using right now because I do have two. So this is 150 watts right here. It's really nice because it, uh, I have, it has barn doors which allow me to direct the light. So if I don't want the light on to, to be on something, I can put the barn door there and block it from coming from that direction. And it also has a built-in dimmer switch, which is basically a little dial here that I can... Uh, <laughs> that I can move here. So I have this one all the way up just because it's it's being reflected off there. Um, but you can turn it really close to down. Um, the thing about dimmer switches though, and, and um, incandescent lights, which these are, as they become dimmer, they become more orange. So you have to worry about that as far as white balance goes. Now I have two other like professional kind of lights and they are, well, and they are 500 watt lights and I don't really want to pull them out right now, so I'm not going to bother because I need to get this video out because it's like 10.30 already, so yeah, that's fun. <laughs> yeah, I can go on about lights all day if you wanted me to, but I won't because I'm sure that would bore you and anyone else who watches. I'll see you in the next video. Good luck. Some